My name is Danielle Meehan. I'm going to be teaching your students in MYP chemistry this year. I have a long background educating and working in hospitals and industry as both a chemist and a biologist. I'm looking forward to bringing real world experience and knowledge into the classroom with your students. I'm very passionate about chemistry and I get really excited to share my love of the subject with your children. I'm thrilled to be back at KAS again this year where I can have the opportunity to watch a whole new group of 10th graders grow and learn as students and human beings. We'll be covering the basics of chemistry this year and doing a lot of work on developing student abilities in the laboratory. We spend the beginning of the year focusing on safety and proper laboratory practices. Students will be working with various chemicals, equipment, and burners this year. And first and foremost, I want them to understand that their safety and the safety of others is all of our concern. Outside of the laboratory, we'll be covering a variety of topics. We'll be discussing matter and how it changes, atomic structure, electrons, the periodic table, and friends across it, my personal favorite, types of chemical reactions, chemical disasters, how chemicals bond with one another, and then possibly we'll end the year with some thermochemistry or stoichiometry. I employ a number of methods to teach students each year. There will be group and individual work, laboratory reports, discussion, online activities, and many others. I'm hoping to include claim evidence reasoning and argument-driven inquiry into the curriculum this year. I hope to make chemistry as interesting and engaging as possible so that all types of learners can be successful. I have high expectations for your students. Chemistry can be a challenging subject, but I will give them every opportunity to work and grow in their understanding. I expect them to come to my class ready to work and participate every day. I do give homework and a variety of projects designed to aid in their understanding. Students do need to take their formative work seriously so that they'll be ready to do well the first time on their summative assessments. I generally allow students to resubmit assignments, but this is not a guarantee and it's meant as an opportunity for improvement and not to aid in their procrastination. In addition to being a teacher here at KS, I'm also the parent of two children. I have a daughter in middle school and a son that's here with me in 10th grade this year. I understand how important it is to us as parents to see our students do well, but I also understand that sometimes life can seem overwhelming for our kids and for us. We live in turbulent times, and while I care about your students' academic success, I also care about their emotional state. Your students should be getting adequate sleep at night so that they can thrive at school and continue to try and be balanced individuals. I encourage both you and your student to reach out to me in, in person or by email if they're encountering any issues. I'm available to students during breaks and lunches as well as really any time after school. I believe that as teachers, we are forging a partnership together with you to help all of our students succeed. If you ever have any questions or concerns, please let me know. As often as possible, I'll also take photos or videos of your students in action. I already have a few great images of them using Bunsen burners and creating fire. I look forward to sharing them with you and sharing their enthusiasm. At the end of the year, my goal is not to produce 70 chemists, but 70 students who can have enjoyed and appreciate chemistry. Most importantly, I hope that they can take that knowledge and relate it to something that they're passionate about. I look forward to meeting you all and working with you this year. Until we meet again, be well. Thank you.